Uh, one second. This, All right, we're rolling. This is off a lacrosse platform. This is where this helmet comes from. It's got a suspension system in it that allows you to unsnap it from the front, pull it inside out, back. put a headset in it, and then drop it back in so you don't have that pressure of a headset. Um, and then you've got a wheel in the back of the helmet that allows you to actually dial down the suspension system and lock it onto your head so that when you put nods on it, it won't Someone's move cool. right, as you drop those nods down in front of your eyes. There you go. And this is Yeah, this op score, and this is a, uh, a fully ballistic helmet, NIG rated, or NIJ rated helmet. It's sort would of been awesome. They originally got into this with their uh, point chin strap system and then took this platform as I told you, from a lacrosse helmet into uh, ballistics uh, using a team out of uh, Virginia Beach for its design. Kind of right, and, um, and it's available multi multi patterns. Obviously, right. this is the hot one now is multi cam. Right, and the chin strap uh, system, the significance of the chin strap system would be? It is. It, the, way, the way it's able to tighten that helmet down and it's completely unobstructed of anything that would go in here, whether it's a circumoral headset, a headset that we've designed, anything like that, it's completely out of the way. Whereas a lot of the point systems that come down drag or hit those headsets and drive them into the side of the head.